Excellent, I'm a doctor now. <laughs> I'm going to do my first gallbladder, I think, Friday night. <laughs> yes, uh, a good friend of mine who's been a very excellent friend here uh, with me for almost 20 years, Alan Penfold, he feels his gallbladder needs a change. So I think I can do it. And uh, his excellent partner, Virginia Ratsoy, has done so much to help me, booking me in here so many times over the almost 20 years. And Brownwin Scott has done so much. And Dr. Roger, Barnsley is awesome, and uh, <laughs> Ms. Strachan is awesome, and uh, you know, ev Mr. Mark is awesome. Everyone is awesome. <laughs> and, and both my mothers drove up from uh, Vancouver today for this. My mom is there here, and uh, my sister Barb is here as well, and excellent friends. Um, and, and John Walsh, and it's a very moving experience for me. Life is a moving experience, isn't it? And I wish you all the most, most happy times, and I wish you all finding your hearts and finding your dreams and finding your brilliant accomplishments all through the road of the great adventure that we're all on from birth, yes? <laughs> so we keep going, yes? And uh, speaking of birth, against my will I was born. I kept putting it off. When I was born, I weighed 12 pounds, 8 ounces. I could not put it off much longer. I could have been born earlier. I did want to be a Scorpio, of course, because it's very intense. Also, I started to forget all the horrible things I'd heard about life and got curious and began to consider the strain on my mother who, of course, thought I was twins. <laughs> Polar bears on Young Street. So Miss Lisa and me were going up Young to see how far it goes. Yes, it's said to be the longest street in the world. On that day anyway, we went north on Young Street, past the 7,000 block, past the turnoff to Barry which was still called Young Street. It's amazing, it's so long. <laughs>